Hey, we're in the middle of our, well, we're at the beginning of our half marathon today, week 20 training. <laughs> we're gonna have footage later. But, whew, it's a nice uh, 40 something degrees. So we go left right. Hey guys! <laughs> hey, so we're, we're almost halfway through. We're doing okay. Yeah. The weather's perfect. Yeah, it is. I feel sorry for all those fools who came home bundled up this morning. I know. Crazy. I know. It's really it's nice. Like 50 baht now. It is nice. It's a little more hilly than we thought, <laughs> but that's okay. It's beautiful out here. We haven't been on these roads. It was really nice. Anyway. We're coming up to the end. Stop. Thank you. Uh, corner, Thank you. Corner. Thank you.
Nathan. Okay. Sometimes boxes get you Half my first, 20 to 29, female. Third place, Danielle Gardner. Thank you. Might be our best yet. We are tired. Boy, talk about a tough week 20. We did it. It's nice. <laughs> hey, 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 thanks for staying with us. So we ran our half marathon today. It was the inaugural half marathon for the city of Georgetown. Week 20 in the books. How are we doing? No, we're fine. So here's <laughs> what happened today. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> and before we get into specifics, just to let you know, today was really a, an awesome day. Um, we we had a great time. We really did. It was a great run. Okay, so tell us about okay. it. Okay, so we woke up really early mm -hmm. for Saturday morning. Mm -hmm. This race actually started 7 a.m. And that's, I love an early start, but that is a little earlier than a lot of races mm -hmm. will start. So we knew we had to wake up, get our breakfast in line, walk the dog, yeah, so basically working backwards, long story short, we woke up at 4.30 this morning. Yeah, and that's, <laughs> that's, that's 4.30 following a time change that we're... Which, let's be honest, I was waking up at 4.30 anyway yeah. because of the time change. Yeah, so... the time change, is, it sucks. Why do we do uh, this to ourselves? And so we're not we're not. How can we not do this to ourselves yet. anymore? So we get up at 4.30. Uh, we have our routine, right? And we've talked mm -hmm. about this. We have our... Uh, 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 we get our, our goodies together for the run. We, we do the uh, sport beans. Mm -hmm. uh, we have our oatmeal, raisin, peanut butter uh, balls that we take with us mm -hmm. for, for energy. We load up our uh, electrolyte Water drinks. bottles, yeah. Uh, we've got our water bottles together. Mm -hmm. uh, today, the temperature was mm. about 47 degrees Fahrenheit, which was great. It was lower than that. Oh, it was no, like actually, 40 when yeah, we started. It, it was around 39, 40 when we no. got going. I think race time, it was probably around 49, 47 to 49. Uh, and, and it was a beautiful uh, weather day. Um... And uh, we got to the we got to the race. Um, parking was uh, interesting. Uh, the 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 place they had it at doesn't really have parking. Yeah, uh, we parked at the church next door mm -hmm. and all of their grounds. And the thing is, like, I guess just because this is a kind of a small town, we didn't expect it to be a big race. But apparently, there were like a thousand people there. A thousand people. They said there were seven hundred. A thousand people registered. Yeah, seven hundred people registered for the half marathon. Mm -hmm. Three hundred people registered for the five k. And this is an inaugural race, uh, so uh, that's a lot of people. Uh, and it was great to see all these people, and it was very well organized. Mm -hmm. uh, the yeah. setup and everything. Uh, watching the video, uh, the setup was uh, really, really yeah. nice. Yeah. What one thing that I thought was awesome. So they had. They didn't have assigned corrals, but they had markers up for your expected finish time so uh we lined up in oh, the yeah. you know 9 30 10 o'clock range uh -huh. and it was so nice to just like everybody was honest about it yeah <laughs> we we ran with people who were obviously about our pace, our pace. Yeah. and it was just like so nice to like from the beginning just kind of like trot along and not have to deal with like getting around people or being like you know blown out of the water by somebody blown by yeah. you and you know it's yeah. just yeah, it was really nice. It was it was nice. hillier than we expected. Oh my god, it was uh, hillier than it was, we expected. It was pretty rough. But oh, in the end, in wow. the end, the scenery was beautiful. We ran Country with roads. A, we ran with an ostrich. We ran with an ostrich, <laughs> we ran with horses. Yeah. There were dogs on the side of the yeah, road. Cows. There were donkeys donkeys and cows. Mm -hmm. Horses, yeah. And it was it was yeah, just it like was a 
awesome little yeah. country it, it run. Was, it, it was, was really nice. awesome. It was really so, nice. uh, we ran it as best we could. Uh, all we wanted to do was make sure that we, uh, we finished, uh, you know, we're, we're, uh, uh, this is week 20. So, uh, here's what happened. We ran our we best. We did all right. We ran our best half marathon ever by 20 <laughs> minutes total. So we're oh, shocked. Yeah. <laughs> we're totally shocked. Yay. Like by 20 minutes, we beat our best time. That, that, that's pretty good. And we didn't really try. We just we just wanted to do it. We wanted to finish. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, it, it felt fantastic. It, it really did. And, and we're just really, really psyched. Um, we crossed the finish line. Uh, really excited. The medals. Oh my gosh. Uh, they're they're beautiful. Hang and, on. And, and, Hang on. It's over here. Hang here on. Oh my gosh. It's just like look how pretty. Yeah. Yeah, it's like stained glass kind yeah, of. Yeah, a little stained yeah. glass thing. I don't think that's oh yeah. there it is. Yeah, they did a really, really it's good job. It's just so nice. So it was really nice. Yeah. Uh they had food and every uh runner uh was uh, able to pick up a free beer from uh, the brewery that was on site and they make a uh, wonderful beer. We love it's our little local brewery. Yeah, we love it. Local brewery. Uh Here's what happened. <laughs> what happened? So around mile 11. Yeah. I was like, you know, I feel a little nauseous. Hmm, I've had this feeling before yeah. with the electrolyte replacement that we're using now. Yeah. Um, and I'm like, oh, I'll be okay. I'll be okay. We'll just keep pushing. We get through the end. So we cross the finish line. I'm like, okay, not feeling great. That's okay. That's okay. Let's just, I just need some food. So we went over to this expansive smorgasbord of, of food. Like, you know, you want breakfast tacos, you want donuts, you want chips, crackers, sodas, bananas, bananas, you know, whatever. Yeah. It was really, really well. Lovely. I mean, a lot of stuff. So. I'm looking at this, I'm like, nothing looks like what I need. I'll start with a banana. So I grabbed a banana, that's fine. And then we got in the beer line and we were almost to the front and I was like, I don't think I can stop. Like I had only made it through like two thirds of my banana mm -hmm. and I had to throw it away. And then I didn't anticipate being able to drink a beer. And then we went home and then So here's the deal. Here's the deal. Uh, you, you know that we've been looking for a good electrolyte. Uh, this is uh, not the one. Replacement. Uh, we started with Drip Drop, which we enjoyed, um, mm -hmm. and then we switched to Noon, which uh, well isn't working for us. Uh, what us? Me. My stomach is not agreeing. With yeah, it. there's something about the Noon. It could be the the partial carbonation that it uh, creates in the water. It could be just the flavors. But, uh, I do fine on shorter runs. If I get past like the 10 mile mark, yeah. I am apparently nauseous. I'm apparently going to throw up because <laughs> it's happened multiple times yeah. now. So noon is out. Yeah. Noon's out. So we're going to either go back to drip drop or we're going to try propel or something else. Mm -hmm. Uh, just, uh, that's, that's the only thing we can, yeah. we can think and of. And the thing is, it's like problems. you figure out what to do before race day. Well, we only have two more super long runs now before yeah. race day. Yeah. So it's like, oh gosh, I hope these other ones work. Yeah. Well, we know that, we know that drip drop works, uh, yeah. and, and, and we know propel works because that's what we've used in the past. So, uh, that's what we're going to switch yeah. to. But so for several hours after the race, uh, you were praying to the porcelain God. It wasn't pretty. Uh, but after... But then uh, once that cleared, we had a great day. Yeah, we had a great day. <laughs> and that's why this uh, video is kind of late today. Uh, we went out to celebrate. And uh, we had a wonderful time. We're really feeling good. Our, our bodies are a little uh, tight, as you would expect after a half marathon. We are going to stretch. Thank you again for continuing to remind us I to actually do that. did that right after the race. Yeah. Because uh, my calves were super <clears throat> tight today. Yeah, yeah. so... Stretching is becoming more of a routine for us, and that's very important because uh, it, it was it was tough. Uh, the hills were really really hard today, weren't they? But we're psyched. Gosh, rough, we yeah. beat our best time by twenty minutes. We feel really really good. So uh, you know we're uh, we're off week twenty in oh, the hi, books. We are posting every week. Now, here's the deal. Reminder. Right. Here's a reminder. Next week, it's probably going to be late. 
Next week is probably going to be posted late because we're going to run early We're going to be morning. at Disneyland. Yeah, we're going to Disneyland. <laughs> so the footage of that run, we will post when we're back in our hotel after celebrating uh, Disneyland to the fullest on our, on our Saturday that we're there. Uh, so hang tight for that one. <laughs> That'll be week 21. We are getting so close. So close. 55 days away today from to when we leave. Marathon, marathon weekend. weekend. We're really excited. No, 54. Because yesterday was 54. Oh, that's right. 54 days. 54 days. We love hearing <laughs> from you. Let us know how you're doing. Keep sending tips and suggestions. This is really exciting stuff. We feel really, really good. Um, if, if not a little sore and tight. But that's okay. We're going to go stretch. Uh, it's, it's, it's pretty, pretty neat. Uh, I think this is the first time that we've run something where we were just running. Yeah. So as a like side note to that, I got a new phone yesterday, which means that I had to like get everything situated on my new phone. Unpairing my watch failed for some reason which you have to do to pair it to the new phone. So I ended up having to reset my watch, which means like everything was like kind of weird over here. Um, I prefer like a kind of pared down view. Like I don't want to see all the stats. I just want to see a couple of stats. Mm -hmm. And I for I didn't realize until we started running. Oh. Like I looked at my watch and it was like all the stats and I can't handle that. Oh. Yeah. So because of that, I didn't look at anything the whole run. Oh. Not until it was, we were like, uh, Four milli. Hey, take take take, take cheesy, take, pal. Take coach. I was like, we were we were running like the home stretch, like four tenths of a mile away, like that yeah. last little yeah. stretch. And I finally looked at our time. I was like, holy crap, we're doing really well. So yeah, technology is awesome, but it's also kind of fun to ignore it. Yeah, <laughs> and that, that's what we did. I mean, uh, yeah. it, it was the, the weather was perfect. There were a ton of people out there. Uh, you know, we were trying to just just get through it and, and um, it was a really really nice surprise so we feel really really good about it yeah. who hope you're doing great hope your trainings come along if that's what you're doing hope you're enjoying this remember subscribe hit like so that we know that uh, what we're doing is uh, something you want to see and remember it is always an adventure with you